Hey everybody, this is Jason Diebel, their puck head as I go by uh, for the Beach Buddy community. I recently did a video where I was talking about building on my set of weights. I'm here in a new house and they didn't have fitness equipment, so I, I kind of had to build it as I go. And when you start with <clears throat> building on your weights, like a set of three pound weights at a dollar a pound is only six bucks. So it's real cheap to build this first set, you know, six bucks, ten bucks, sixteen. 20, 24, and 30 bucks. So you can build this whole row for about, you know, less than $100. And I think everybody needs that first set of weights. Going on after that, it starts to get more expensive. Two 25-pound dumbbells is 50 pounds. Two 50-pound dumbbells is, is $100. $50 and then $100. So what I was suggesting is every increment after about 30, I was suggesting to get these plate mates, and each one's two and a half pounds, so if you put these on a 30 pound dumbbell, that's 35. So you wouldn't actually need to buy 35s, you could skip right to 40s. And after 40s, use these for 45s and buy 50s. So, um, that's a great option, that's what I was trying to do here. But I've already got 50 pound dumbbells, and I've already got 60 pound dumbbells back at my other house. So what I did here, and, and here's here's a an admission. <laughs> I'm super anal about weights. Like, I went to Big Sports and they have every size weight I would want, but they're a different color. They're like dark brown instead of gray. And so I know just with my neurotic self, if I was to look down and see those brown weights, they would just aggravate me. So I looked all over, and really the majority of these weights I just bought at Walmart. Um, pretty cheap and still decent quality. I looked all over, I looked online, and the one place that had them pretty cheap um, was Walmart. And they do like free shipping to your house or to the store. So to buy these still, you know, was about a dollar a pound. And like I say, anything above 50 pounds um, gets a little bit expensive. But sure enough, I was able to find these and have them delivered. That's still a pretty affordable price. Now, one thing I want to say about this is I just I just did a series of videos opening up and, and assembling a bunch of power box equipment. And I was super impressed with the way that everything was packed, everything came in great shape. Well, when I'm opening this box from Walmart, number one, like it's already popped through. It looks like somebody had already taped around that part knowing it was gonna pop through. And then this this like I wouldn't even pick up. The dumbbell in this box because it's just so flimsy. Um, so there's something to be said for you know the quality that goes into shipping something like this. But the weight itself pretty hard to screw up. Um, going with the five pound increment idea, I skipped fifties again. I got fifties at home, so when I take this entire weight set back to my house, I will have fifties and I will have fifty fives. So instead of getting another set of 50s, I went to the 55s. And my 50 pounds will now be 45 plus five. And then from 50s, I can go to 60s if I go to 55 plus five. Um, so the next set I got here is 65. And with the plate mates, that'll allow me to get all the way to 70 pounds. And I think 70 pounds is kind of like the sweet spot for most people's home gym. If you're doing much more than 70, then it probably makes sense to have a gym membership. Or it's going to be so convenient for you to have the 80 pounds at home that you don't mind spending the extra $160 to get one set of weights. But honestly, at that point, I would really recommend something like the Power Blast because here I have 90 pound dumbbells for a total of 357, and they do everything this, this rack does. So, um, probably not necessary that I go ahead and show you a box in each one of these. It's going to be the same thing. I don't know which size is which. Um, but one more thing I do want to show. That all stayed together pretty good. But yeah, every part of this box says made in China. I mean, just nothing gets against the Chinese. <laughs> but it's just, it's, it's not the same quality. So something like those um, the American owned company with the power box. I mean, I, I literally assembled $1,500 worth of power box equipment, and uh, there was only one item in there that said made in China. So 
So just to show. This is 65. Well, get pretty heavy. So I think you see there's enough room here for 55 and another 65, which will complete this whole rack. And that's that's my last point that I really want to make is when, when I first got started with this, I bought one of these little two stand, two tier racks. I could fit maybe five sets of weights. And I got my six set of weights and I had to upgrade. And then finally I went to a three tiered rack, but it was like straight up and down. It wasn't staggered like this. So it was really hard to get those middle and bottom weights in. So then finally I went to a staggered weight bench and it was like one foot shorter. I think the standard on this is like 32 inches or something wide. So that was big enough, but it was only big enough for about 40 pounds. And then as soon as you start growing where you want to get up to 60, 70 pounds, it just wasn't big enough. And then this is the first rack I found. The maker is Xmark. Um, and I'll put a link down below in the comments so that you can go and find the same rack. Literally, it took me hours and hours of research to find one that I wanted. And since I've found this rack and bought it the first time, I've bought one, two, three, three additional more, and I recommend them to four or five of my friends, and not one complaint from all those folks. So, just a couple tips here. You know, the plate mates, buying every increment at five pound intervals, you know, using the free shipping with Walmart or the free ship to store that they have, saving a little bit of money that way, and just uh, hopefully that helps you assemble your rack and get your fitness on. I work as a full-time Beachbody coach. If you have any questions about weights like this or about the Beachbody products or the power blocks, feel free to send me a personal message. I'd love to help. And uh, if you enjoy this video and want more tips like this, subscribe to our channel. We're doing a series of tips around fitness equipment, um, how to set it up, if it's something I recommend or something I'm not so happy with. Thank you.